I just completed moving. Thank you to Tim, James, no thanks to Justin. But uh, I just moved about a mile away from where I had been living, down by the beach. And uh, I moved into the house that I grew up in when I was a little kid till I was eight years old. And uh, I've actually moved into the room where I was conceived. All right, for sex, okay. Well, here's the thing. I talked to Tim about this a little bit earlier, but in the same house, a lot of things have happened to me. And it's kind of strange going full circle in my life and being the beginning point and the end point, end point, end point, end point, end point, end point. But uh, what also happened in that house was my grandfather passed away there about two and a half years ago, which precipitated me moving in. Uh, and I actually sat there through him dying over about two and a half year period. And uh, my grandfather, I'll tell a quick story. My grandfather was in the war. Uh, he didn't find any, he was in Japan. I'm uh, sorry, he's in the Philippines. Uh, and he's a Spanish citizen and they, the Japanese invaded a lot. And at some point while he was there trying to get diapers for my uncle, uh, he was shot out a whole bunch and beat up by this Japanese guy. Well, skip ahead where the United States and Uncle Sam come and kick some ass. He was walking by. He saw the same guy who had uh, beat him up on the side of the road, slowly dying. He said, I didn't really understand about the wound. And the way he told the story, Tim, is that he saw his shoes. Oh, the guy had stolen his shoes. He saw his shoes, took his shoes back off the guy, beat him in the face till he was dead. And I sat there trying to reconcile that with a wheezing man who just wanted family members surrounding him and feeling sorry for him. And I couldn't do it. This song is for people who overstay their welcome. It's called Cure for Cancer. Oh, wow. 